everyone, happy 2014. I can't believe it's a brand new spanking new year and I'm so excited and looking forward to planning lots of things and it's just really cool that it's January. Um, I hope you had a wonderful Christmas and new year. I unfortunately have been quite poorly with a cold, a stinking cold and chest infection. You can probably still hear it in my voice, so I'm sorry if it affects the, the, the quality of this video at all. One of my subscribers, Dionysus Dreams, hello, um, tweeted me and requested that I film a what I got for Christmas video. Now, I've never done this sort of video before. Um, I just want to say, first of all, like as a little disclaimer, that I'm in no way showing off at all. That's just not me or my personality. Um, really lovely that she tweeted me in the first place and requested this video. This is the first present that my boyfriend Mel bought for me. It's a French style dressing table and I just think it's so pretty. I've got all my makeup and my skincare things on the on the front. There's a lovely big mirror and um, there's a place for my Muji storage and I just think it looks really pretty and I really enjoy getting ready here every day. This is actually from a shop in the UK called Duna Mills and it's from their Toulouse range in case you're interested and I was a very lucky girl because I got this in October. I was a bit scared that they were going to sell out so um, he kindly bought it for me two months before Christmas and I've been enjoying and loving it since. He also got me a few presents which I could open on Christmas Day, the first of which came in this gorgeous white bag. Inside was my favourite perfume, it's J'adore by Dior, Eau de Parfum, and I absolutely love this. Let me show you what the bottle looks like, it's really really pretty, it actually looks like a magical potions inside. Really love the packaging and the smell is just... Oh, I love this. I'm so happy with this. Thank you. He also got me a few things from my favourite makeup shop, MAC. The first of which is um, a 217 blending brush. Let me just pop this out for you so you can see. I also got two eyeshadows, which I've really put into my quad palette. Let me show you what they are. The top one is All That Glitters, and the bottom one is Mulch, and I think that they particularly complement um, brown eyes. Love MAC eyeshadows for their great staying power, and the fact that they give um, relatively little, if any, fall down. So, really good quality eyeshadows, check out MAC. I also got this blusher, which I'm absolutely thrilled about. It's a sheer tone blush, it's Pincho Peach. Let me also show you what this looks like. Love MAC blushes, think that they're really highly pigmented and um, this actually makes me want summer to come really, really quickly. Lovely, lovely pinky colour for summer, so love this. The next thing that I unwrapped came in this gorgeous red and gold box and it's from Estee Lauder. Now, you know when you're getting something from Estee Lauder that it's going to be good. So I opened it and I was kind of bouncing up and down. And inside, whoops, there's lots of different things in here. But the main thing, the main present, is the Advanced Night Repair Serum. And I have been trying out samples of this as it's recently been reformulated. And I really like the um, formulation, the newer formulation. And have noticed a dramatic difference in improvement in my skin in terms of anti-aging. I think my fine lines have um, reduced in appearance, my skin feels and appears plumper and I just really like what this has done. So let me just show you what it looks like. Comes in this little brown bottle and if you screw unscrew this there's a little pipette where you can take as much or as little as you need and this for me is a nighttime treatment. Well, I guess it's called advanced night repair. So yes, Sam, it's a night treatment. Inside the box, there were some other things that they threw in for free. One of which was their Modern Muse um, perfume and two little um, testers for the advanced night repair eye. So I love samples. I love it because you can just try something out for free. If you like it, you buy it. If you don't, then you just don't. So I think samples are the way to go. He also got me this mirror, illuminating mirror. I love it so much, hope you can see it. Um, you plug it in, it's got a big round light and this is like normal magnification. The other side is like five times magnification, which is great if you want to pluck out your eyebrows or squeeze that little annoying little zit. Um, you could get in really up close and personal with this kind of mirror and I'm really, really thrilled to have this, so thank you. My final present came in this rather large, 
And inside were these brown boots, which I really, really like. They're from Clark's. They're brown, they're leather. They s I love the smell of leather. And these, these really pong of leather. So ah, love them. And particularly like the zips on the reverse of the boot. See myself wearing these with blue jeans, nice cuddly, cuddly jumper and perfect for winter. So really, really happy with these. I got some really nice presents from my parents. The first of all being this little bad boy in here from um, our little friend Moe. Love the box. I'm sure you know what's inside, so um, I won't say what it is, but really happy with this. Looks so blingy. I also got a lovely body wash set from Bayliss and Harding. Thank you, mummy. My rents also got me some Avon eyeshadow palettes. This one is emerald cut and looks like this. I really like the colours in this palette and I don't know if you can see but they've numbered the shadows 1, 2, 3 and 4 and there is a little diagram on the reverse of the packaging to just tell you where, where the colours go which I think is really handy if you know, you're know you not too familiar where you should put the different colours. Love the greens, the forest greens and the peach and the champagne yellow colour. So that was in Emerald Cut. I also got a Luxe Avon eyeshadow palette and it looks like this. <gasps> so pretty and the eyeshadows oh, so nice let me see let me see got some mauves some greys and some greens and oh sorry that was probably a bit close <laughs> really like this and this is in glamorous roses my best chummy ling got me a really handy present from the body shop and it's a facial massager and um, she was telling me that Caroline Hirons, who's a, a beauty skincare guru, had highly recommended this and it's apparently really good for your face. If you roll it on your face, it helps get rid of any facial cellulite and any uneven skin and it's really good. You should just give yourself a little rub here and there. Actually, why don't I get it out and have a go? It feels surprisingly nice. A little bit ticklish. <laughs> she also got me a super thoughtful present and that is Primark vouchers. I'm so happy I can go to Primark now and I've got free spending. I'm so happy with this and she knows me so well. I love Primark. Oh, I haven't been in ages. I probably haven't been since I did my Primark haul back in um, October. So I'm so happy I've got Primark vouchers. My other best chummy Dawn also bought me two really thoughtful presents. The first of which is this Carmex moisturising lip balm. I've been so sick um, over the last two weeks. This has really been a lifesaver for me. And I haven't actually ever tried this lip balm range out. And I've got to say I'm really impressed with it, really like it. And it's been a real lifesaver, so thank you very much. My lips are now beautiful and plump and moisturised and soft. So really, really happy about that she's sort of recommended and given me this. I've also been flirting with the idea of purchasing a MacBook Pro um, with Retina display. Now, as you know, Apple products don't come cheap and inside this card that Dawn gave me there was a very sweet message and inside she also included a um, Apple voucher which is so thoughtful and generous because it brings me that little bit closer to being able to buy the Pro and um, I'm going to save really really hard and hopefully I can buy it and hopefully my video editing will be better because I know at the moment it's a little bit basic and I do apologise but hopefully when I do eventually buy one it will be a bit more fancy so thanks for sticking with me and um, those are all the things that I got for Christmas this year. I hope you enjoyed this video. I am so thankful for all the presents that I've received. I'm so thankful for the time that it took to go to the shop and buy them, the thought process, and the just sheer generosity. If you have any ideas for videos, um, things that you'd like to see or watch, then please do leave a comment below. I'm also on Instagram if you want to fly by and come say hi and do like message me on Twitter I will respond to you I love Twitter sometimes I find it hard to think of things witty things to say I think sometimes you have to be so witty on there so that's why I prefer Instagram but you know if you have any questions or just want to chat just you know hit me up on there it'd be great to sort of get a thing going okay thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye bye